Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, today in this video I'm going to be doing Escaping the Minigames Lobby. Uh, this is a better one because I did mention this in my uh, previous stream I did two days ago, or three days ago. Uh, basically, uh, it's from a YouTuber called Trouble Chair. Um, yeah, the Trouble Chair. Um, I'm not sure if he found this originally or not, but uh, I should have a link to his uh, thing in the description. Uh, but basically, it's the way I did, but I uh, mind you can only go under the map. Um, and then you get like lost and everything. Uh, but no, for this one you can actually get on the castle walls and everything as you will see. In fact, no, I'll probably use the same thumbnail as last time because honestly, I really can't be asked to do another thumbnail, but yeah. Um, I know I'm lazy, deal with it. <laughs> but yeah. So basically you just want to win a game. I did have to just kick everyone, so I apologise to everyone who was just in the game with me. Um, but once you win a game, um, or if it's an invite only game, you can invite your friend, tell them what's going on, then win the game and then you can kick them, whatever. So then, yeah. Um, basically to win a game, get the elytra, and as you see, you can just, like, fly around. So basically, you want to do the same as, um, that in the other one. Uh, but if you haven't watched that video, just in case, uh, I will show you. Um, uh, so you just come up the stairs, and you go into this little, like, tavern kind of thing. Don't know what it is, but, yeah. Um, in fact, I might turn my, I'm gonna turn my music down a bit, because you might not be able to hear me too well. Um, and then you just have to, like, go on all the roofs and everything. You have to, like, Assassin's Creed it. <laughs> I say it every time. I don't know why. It's just, like... Uh, yeah. Let me just sort my mic out. Right, there we go. Fine. Right, okay. Um, and then, make sure not to fall off. But obviously, it doesn't really matter if you fall off, because you can just do it again. Uh, but then, you're going to come down to this uh, one uh, block gap. You can just... So, you just have to spam the button, and then you, get, you can fit through. And then, jump down here. And then, it's this way. Uh, fuel the redstone, but yeah, so see, you can actually get on the castle walls, and if I remember it correctly, we should be able to get on them fairly quickly. And mostly there are some vines, and basically what you want to do is just climb on these vines, and uh, get out. Uh, oh, okay. So yeah, this is the problem, that you have to keep kicking everyone, so I apologise to anyone if you're watching this video who's trying to join my game, and if you got kicked. I literally, like, I made a game, and then, like, one person joined. And then, like, another person joined, and then by the time I had won that game, I think we played Dig. Um, by the time we finished that game, there were, like, seven people in my game, not including me. So I had to kick, like, seven people from the game, and I'm like, sorry, guys. <laughs> but, yeah. So you just want to climb this tree. Uh, it's just over here. And then jump onto the spit. Um, and then... Oh, my God. I apologise. Uh, climb on this tree, and then get to this little bit. And then, from here, you can just climb on these trees. Like, so, I actually remember the way. I'm very proud of myself. I've never been so proud. Um, and then, as you see, guys, you can get on the castle walls. Um, so, obviously, um, you can just, like... Oh, that was close. <laughs> um, you can just watch everyone down below and everything. It's pretty cool. I think in the video, he just ran around this bit. You can, like, look at all the fireworks dispensers and everything. Uh, so, it's better than the other one, because on the other one, I didn't obviously didn't really know that you could do this. You could only go, like, un under the map, and then, like, if you fell off, then you had to leave and everything. But actually, you can properly get out on this one, not just on the castle walls, but you can explore, like, this jungle and everything. On the video as well, yes, he, like, he went, like, down there as well. And everything. So it's actually pretty cool. We can have a little look how they made it and everything. A bit behind the scenes, you know. Um, but obviously, I think the disadvantage, obviously, you have to keep, keep, uh, keep kicking people until you've done it. And then, like, you can have someone join, they could be up here, just like, oh, hi. Yeah, um, <laughs> about that. Okay, so I uh, see. Can we actually look in any of these? I don't think we can look in any of them, to be honest. But uh, yeah, right, okay. Um, in fact, actually, I might have my own original thumbnail. Uh, I am gonna make my own thumbnail. I'm not lazy. In fact, yeah. Should we just like? Should we just knock kick these people? Should we just like stay on the castle walls and just see what they do if they do anything? Right, okay. If I just like keep running around on this, I bet they get really confused with it. What? Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, like I said, um, I'm doing battle mode because on battle mode. Well, on glide, actually, on glide. Um, on glide, sometimes it, um... If actually, I need to do the thumbnail, don't I? So I actually have to kick these people. Okay, one of them left already. <laughs> well, um, basically, um... Cool, sorry. Um, you stay on the castle walls and everything. No, <laughs> what am I talking about? I don't know. Um, see how forgetful I am and everything? Sorry, because like, my phone just went off and distracted me. I keep messing everything up. Uh, yeah, <laughs> lol. Uh, but yeah, sometimes in Glide, when you win the game, it doesn't spawn you on the balcony. But on battle mode, it always spawns you on that balcony. If you win the game, that is, then yeah. Uh, but guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, so this is a improved one. Obviously, I think 
There was another one where you, like, if you do it with another player, they do a fishing rod and then you can like get loads of like two players up. Which I think might be helpful, but that one does kind of look a bit awkward and harder. Well, on this one, you can only do it with one person. And uh, yeah, so guys, thank you very much for watching. Um, hope you enjoyed. Um, ugh. Sorry, I haven't uploaded in like a while. And obviously, I know I did that stream the other day, but yeah. Um, it's just because, again, well, I have a half term. We've got I have a week off now. Um, so it should be good. Um, but yeah, so my outro is right and everything. And yeah, so. Yeah, I don't know what my next video or stream is going to be, but you know, it might just be another Minecraft glide challenge. But yeah, right, okay, guys, so thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.